Yevgeny, an incredible match out there. You've just beaten the seven-time champion of uh, Dubai, Roger Federer. Describe your emotions right now. Uh, <laughs> I think I will feel this full emotions a little bit later, but now I just I'm very, very happy. I mean, uh, when I was coming on court, I was thinking about do my best, and of course, you're always thinking to win, but in the deep of your spirit, you know, inside of you, you was thinking, okay, um, okay, just do your best and show that you you're good, <laughs> not 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 lose easy, you know. I mean, I didn't have thought that, but you know, the emotions are crazy, and uh, I'm pretty sure it will be even more after after I come to my room and analyze everything. You saved match points in that uh, second set, and then were broken serving for the match yourself in the third set. Five one down in the in the tiebreak in the third set. I mean, you just wouldn't lie down. Yeah, I'm um, the six five. Third set and serving it was um, I get pretty tight and um, mentally as well. I didn't play very bad, but just a little not first serves, which is easy for Roger. He can be aggressive since the beginning of the point. So yeah, and then five one. It, it's actually the you know that it's reflecting of this five six five and losing a serve like still was down, and then was became one five. And then uh, just step by step, you know, when you're winning one point, then you return good, win a point. And then I return winner, and I feel like, yeah, now I'm, I'm here, I can do it. And so. Yeah, it was an incredible match to watch. And, and the crowd were on your side as well. Obviously, Roger's going to have a big fan club wherever he goes, but it felt like there was quite a few Russians out there tonight. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I think in Dubai, it's a lot of Russians and uh, tourists. I mean, maybe some also living here. But uh, yeah, I, I heard many, many words, Russian words during playing. Yeah, I was pretty, pretty, pretty happy to hear it, you know, when I just came on court, when I come from court during the match. Yeah, they were supporting very well today, but not, not bad, you know, like sometimes they scream on before the serving, but it was really polite and very nice. And you came through qualifying, and then when you saw you were in, you could meet Roger, you know, uh, in the draw, what was your approach prior to the match? Honestly, I was pretty, pretty hoping not to get on this spot of Mikhail Yuzhny, because, um, I mean, it's pretty tough to play against him because we work, we practice together, we have the same coach and um, it's not, not easy. It was, and I was really hoping like, okay, even Berdic was will be okay for me, but not Misha because we played two weeks ago, but he was injured. But anyway, you know, it's not never easy. And I was thinking, okay, Roger is good, but not Misha, please. And it's happened. And then, yeah, yesterday I played good and was pretty, maybe more lucky than uh, Misha. And today was, yeah, <laughs> you feel, feel like after the win Misha, I was like, okay, is it Roger tomorrow? Uh, it's like a dream come true. Well, when you've had a chance to calm down, you've got a quarter-final to play. Um, thoughts of play, about playing Luca Pui? Um, uh, yeah, and I played him once and uh, we know each other. He's three years younger or two years younger than me. We played him, I played him and uh, he know me, I know him. It was just trying to recover as fast as I can and do my best tomorrow again.